Good luck, everybody, in Series 1 Baseball Jumbo. Uh, let's start with the random and see who's getting what teams right now. Seven times through for the owner names, seven times through for the teams. All right, lucky number seven. So the first random is all done. Now we go over to the team random. Right here we go, seven times. Lucky number seven. Joseph K., you have the Yankees, the Angels, Lewis, Tampa Bay. Tampa Bay is owned by Fred. All right, I just got this in alphabetical order. And let's go ahead and start up through. Are there any trades? There's so many great teams to own in here. Maybe somebody wants to swap around. Nice, Dylan Carlson. Good way to start the break off there for the St. Louis Cardinals owner, Craig. Ho! Ho! Boom. Minnesota Twins, nice Sano, nice Astros card, Golden Parallel, Chipper Jones, Josh Donaldson,
There's a Water Franco rookie card for the Rays. A number to 50 Yankees parallel. Boom. All right. Nice one. Look at this Jaron Duran rookie card. Nasty. Red Sox odor. Nice one there. That was Greg with the Red Sox. Going down the Duran Silver. Spike Trout. Oh, more Red Sox. Oh, Boston Pride. Nice one, Greg. A really nice Cal Lewis there, too. Gold foil. So Greg has a first hit out of the rip with the Red Sox. We have two hits left. Bada bing, bada boom. There's Otani. There's a Jaron Duran. Bryce Harper for the Phillies. Tatis. Nice Wander Franco, a run challenge. Very nice, Pat Padres. Casey Mize. Okay, so here is a nice parallel for the national zoner. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Joseph K., that's number down, my friend, to 299.
very nice Acuna there and man I'm kind of surprised we got four packs left and still two hits still two hits left what is going on here What is going on? There's a hit. It's a San Francisco Giants Craig Bat Relic type hit. Nice. KB. Nice rookie card, 87 top style. So hit number two goes ahead and pops out there. But the the hit that's left is an auto. Very nice here for the Angels. Could the autograph be in a silver pack? Is that where the autograph is? Nice rookie card there, Tampa. Andrew Vaughn, Future Stars. Okay, here we go in the final pack. Good luck, everybody. What's it going to be? Coming up here in the final pack. It is a redemption. Oh, my. Oh, could it be a Wander Franco redemption? What kind of redemption is it? Oh my gosh, what is it? Brandon Marsh for the Angels. That's a pretty good one. He's going to get to uh, get a lot of playing time this year in the outfield. Uh, I believe he's taking Mike Trout's center field spot. I believe so. That's been the talk around the Angels camp. Uh, that's really nice, man. A black parallel. Does anybody uh, know what the black parallel is number two? I think it's pretty low. 
I said, I think that's a nice hit. It's no wonder Franco, though. <laughs> no wonder Franco hit, but. Still a lot of fun getting in some tops jumbo with us. Let's hit some rookies here. Maybe we can pull a Franco right here. I want to see some rookies. We do have, it looks like a parallel coming. No rookies. Except this one. All right. So we got a nice parallel rookie card for the Pirates. Number two, 150. So let's see about this autographed black parallel. Baseball stars autographed black parallel. So real quickly, we're just going to look. I want to, I just want to see what it's number two. Um, and be able to show that in the video recording that we're doing right now. So that, let's see if we can find it on eBay and see how big of a hit this Brandon Marsh is. Anything coming? Number to 99. So I don't think there's one that's that's out on the market right now. That's kind of good for the owner of the Angels. And yeah, it's it's number to ninety nine, okay. So around an eighty five dollar hit probably. Okay, there's a black parallel sold for sixty five. There's one for eighty six. Uh, yeah, he's actually gonna be a pretty good player when you look at what kind of chances he's gonna have for the Angels. He is gonna be playing right away. And uh, I'll, sh I'll just post up this about him real quick, and we'll move on into the next break. We have a lot of great stuff coming up, but uh, it's just really cool. The more you know about some of these hits, the more fun it is to follow their careers and everything. And so here's the latest on Marshall, on, um, on Brandon Marsh. Mike Trout's going to play in the minor league on, uh, game on Sunday. So I had something about, well, is he going to take center field away from Trout? And are they going to try to, you know, manage uh, lessen Trout's uh, workload by, by taking Trout out of center field? So I kind of wanted to share that article, but I'm not finding it right away. So we're just going to move on. I'll see if I can find it a little later there about Brandon Marsh's progress as a prospect and everything. So anyway, pretty good stuff. Um, good luck, everybody, in our next box break. We're going to be ripping up more great things around here. Let's take a look 